Hi guys and welcome back to this video. So today I want to talk about something that I'm very passionate about and I want to just speak from my heart on this topic because it's something that um, is near and dear to me um, and something that I've struggled with over the years and I want to talk about being a perfectionist. And as nurses I feel like a lot of us are this way. We want to be the best nurses we can be. We want to do everything. We take pride in our work and that's not a bad thing at all. But when I was a new nurse, I graduated, I got my first job on a tally floor, and I felt like I had to do everything on my own. Looking back, it's almost like I had to prove to everyone else around me that I could do this job, I could be a good nurse. And in order to do that, I felt like I needed to do everything on my own. I couldn't ask for help, I couldn't delegate, because in order to be like the other more experienced nurses, I needed to do everything on my own. I want you guys to listen to me. I want to give you guys permission to not be perfect, to not take every single thing on yourself and to ask for help when you need it. There's no shame in asking for help. It does not mean that you're a weak nurse. And in fact, it means that you are a strong nurse because you're utilizing the people around you to support you. And nursing is a team sport. It's a team job. You cannot do this job alone and if you try to, you are going to burn out, you're going to struggle and you're going to beat yourself up like I did when you are just drowning in the workload. Now that I have a couple years of experience and I actually precept other nurses now, I have noticed that this is a very, very common thing for new grad nurses or um, nurses when they're transitioning maybe to the ICU or to the ER. You guys feel like you have to prove yourselves, like you have to take on everything. And I'm not saying that's a bad quality because you are motivated and that's awesome. But I want you guys to feel okay with asking for help. And I wanna see that when I'm precepting someone, I want you to say, hey, I'm really behind. Do you mind just checking that blood sugar for me next door? Hey, do you mind helping me clean up this patient? Don't feel like you need to take everything on yourself because you're just, you are going to end up struggling and burning out. I know this video is not gonna resonate with everyone, but it will resonate with a lot of you guys. I like to think of myself as a recovering perfectionist. I am still working on this every single day. I am a perfectionist. I carry this to the extreme in every aspect of my life, whether it's cleaning or finances or my relationships with people. I like things to be perfect and I like to be in control and that's just part of my personality and I'm working every day to be better at that. It also has carried into my nursing world and I think that makes me a strong nurse in a lot of ways, but I've also had to learn how to adapt how to ask for help to make me even a stronger nurse. I also want to say that as a new nurse, don't compare yourselves to anyone. Don't compare yourselves to the other new nurse that started the same week as you. Don't compare yourself to the 40 year seasoned nurse who has been in the same unit for the last 38 years. You're not them and that's okay because you have a lot of strengths and qualities that you're gonna bring to the table just as they do. You cannot go in as a new nurse and expect yourself to be at the same level as a nurse who has been working for 38 plus years. It's just not possible. <laughs> they are like, you know, you guys know, seasoned nurses are a beast. They are like what I strive to be like. I wanna be that like hardcore seasoned nurse. And I'm getting there, but I'm not there yet. And that's okay because there's a lot of qualities that I bring that maybe that seasoned nurse doesn't have. I recently got out of school earlier than they have. And so maybe my knowledge base is a little more current or maybe I'm a little more updated on skills. That's great, that's awesome. That's one strength that you might bring that they may not have, but you can't compare because we all bring something to the table and we're all different nurses and that's okay. I hope this message spoke to some of you guys. Leave me a comment down below. Let me know how this resonated with you. If it's something that spoke to you or not, or if you don't resonate with this at all, let me know your, hmm, your favorite breed of dog in the comments below. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video.